After six weeks of protesting their innocence from a Peruvian jail, Michaela McCollum and Melissa Reed have pleaded guilty to drug smuggling. Melissa. It's a move that will likely see a possible 15-year sentence slashed in half. There aren't any statements. I can't make any statements until after the sentencing. The law says I can't make statements. Thank you. Their Peruvian lawyer says he's barred by law from making any statements until after official sentencing. But it's thought the women's legal team could be working to see them serve their time in a UK prison. It looks like the Peruvian authorities are quite keen to have them uh, dealt with quickly and probably sent home quicker than usual. The sentence they'll get is, will be reduced from the minimum eight years by one-sixth. That means it looks like a sentence of six years and eight months that they'll be given by the Peruvian court, of which probably no more than half of it will be served in Peru, the rest in the United Kingdom. The two have admitted trying to fly from Peru to Spain with £1.5 million worth of cocaine stashed in food packets in their luggage. They had insisted that an armed gang had forced them into it, threatening them and their families. I was forced to take these bags in my luggage. Yeah. Uh, your, um, uh, your note uh, contained drug, drugs. I did not know that. But police and prosecutors in Peru said from the start that they believed the women were fully responsible for their actions. The UK Foreign Office has confirmed there is a prisoner transfer agreement between the UK and Peru. The women's families say they're hopeful a deal can be reached that would see them brought home. Amanda Walker, Sky News.